nice. Good morning, iPhone. Welcome back to today's vlog. I'm saying good morning. It's actually afternoon now. We've been up this morning and had quite a slow morning, actually. The girls have done a little bit of school work. Isla was very excited because she got to go on the Zoom app with a group of her friends from school. It's been really difficult to get her be all of her best friends able to be free at the same time um, with the work parents and work commitments and things. So it was really nice for her this morning. Obviously Isabel and Esme both have their own phones so they can just FaceTime their friends when they want. Isla doesn't have a phone though so she can't do that. So it was really nice for her this morning. She spent 40 minutes I think was the limit they had. Chatting to all her friends, giggling in the bathroom, they did I don't know what they were doing. She had dolls in there. They were playing dolls via the Zoom app and it was wonderful. I'm so happy for her. And um, they've just finished doing that now and they're just upstairs sorting a few bits out. And I'm about to, uh, Chris is just printing off some uh, labels for some packaging that I need to do. Little man's just had breakfast number two. Jace, you just had breakfast number two. Hey, it'll be lunchtime in an hour. And then back to bed for you. He's like, no, -uh, I don't think so. <laughs> Tomorrow marks two weeks. In fact, by the time you're watching this today, marks two weeks since we got back from the Maldives. So oh, I feel so relieved that none of us picked up the virus whilst we were on our travels and we're all okay. None of us have sh shown any signs of any symptoms or anything like that. And I think two weeks is the maximum amount of, amount of time it takes for the virus to come out. Although we did read up online that it usually comes out within like four to five days, but we did give it the full two weeks and I'm so, so relieved um, that none of us seem to have picked up the virus whilst we've been away. Speaking of which, I cannot believe it's been a whole two weeks since we were in the Maldives. In fact, that holiday feels like an absolute lifetime ago now, right? <laughs> Whilst we were in the Maldives, I actually was thinking it's so weird that I've been in the sunshine and I haven't got a cold saw. Usually when I go in the sun, the UV rays send my cold saws crazy. And I was so glad. Oh, what's wrong? I was so glad and then I woke up this morning and BAM! Got no foundation on today because I've got a cold sore right there coming. Should we get you out and go get you dressed? Hey! Come on! Is that funny? We we'll go get dressed? Hey! Yeah! Let's go get dressed! Get back here. Get back here. You wanna go down your slide? Ooh. Guys, I absolutely love this outfit, but the last time Jace wore it, somebody messaged to say he had it on back to front. And <laughs> now I don't know which way it goes. The only reason I put it this way round is because on the little strap things there, on the front, or the thing that I call the front, there's buttons. Wait till he stands up and you'll see what I mean. Oh! going down your slide can you see there it's like a little tiny button so i thought it went that way but <laughs> now i'm not sure <laughs> yay this is jace's new trick he just whoa ready <laughs> is it funny this step and slide i got from um the playtime company on instagram lots of you guys keep messaging asking who've missed me saying where it's from previously so i got the step and slide and the ball pit as like a package and they also do another package with some other soft play bits but i haven't bought that yet i might buy that when we move to our new house because it won't fit in this one anyway it's from the playtime company on instagram and this thing here is called a caterpillar and we were gifted this from a company on instagram called caterpillar and and um, they're meant to go on cots but i absolutely love it on the ball pull however i do get fed up of this tail thing happening jace loves to pull them off <laughs> it's, i feel like i spend my day picking balls up and putting these back oh my baby einstein <laughs> Jace literally loves this present they got off my nana for his birthday. Wow! <laughs> Little Einstein. Good morning 
So today, me and the girls thought we would do something super duper fun and cool. So, I wrote down loads of different activities. Good ones, really good ones, really bad ones. I have loads of different activities for us to do. So one at a time, we're going to pick out an activity and we have to do that activity. So it could be something really fun, like colouring, or it could be something really bad, like having like doing crazy things so it's it's going to be a bunch of different things um and activities so it may be good it may be really bad esme are you ready to pick it you've got to close your eyes though okay i really hope you don't pick a bad one As it is such a nice day, we're going to go outside and get some nice fresh air and do the workout out here. my um, T-Rex running right now. Right. Okay, it's time for Isla to choose. Are you ready? Yes. Okay, I'm gonna put some around. Yes. What does it say? Yes! What does it say? Go close! Isla, Isla You choose mine. Izzy. Izzy dress as mine. As mine. Does so Isla. I get to pick your clothes. I get to pick Isla's clothes. And you get to pick Matt. So the last clip you just watched was the girls and they literally had the best idea this morning to put like a ball together full of activities to do and then draw them out of a hat and just do them. Something to keep themselves occupied and have a bit of fun with as well, which we thought was a great idea. Until the clip before you just watched when they all just literally broke out into World War 3 over picking an outfit for each other. Not gonna lie and say that today has been a bed of roses because it definitely hasn't been a bed of roses. Today has been probably the first day that everyone has been really, really fractious with each other. Tempers are high, fuses are short, and the girls are not getting along today whatsoever. I think the whole novelty of being off school that first week is definitely starting to wear off and the reality of being stuck at home between the house, garden, that one bit of exercise that they can do per day is, is starting to set in. And they're all getting a bit tired of each other. <laughs> Sarah and I are the same. We definitely are having one of them days today. I'm not saying me, me and Sarah are definitely not fighting today, but we're definitely, fight. we're, we're not, I don't I'll wanna fight. fight with you, man. I'll but fight. But, we're, <laughs> but we're definitely having one. Yes, we've still got JC's banner, back up, banner up. It's yes. birthday. It's Isla's birthday day. soon, so we're just recycling it all the way, you know? Whatever, <laughs> it's all good. Wanna cherish the number one birthday for as long as we can, so it's staying up. Why? Why has Jace been in bed for an hour and a half? Well, I'm, I'm still oh. sat here watching Peppa Pig. <laughs> <laughs> Just noticed that, that's funny. Um, Do you know what it is, right? Is that families who spend all day long together, especially when you're a big family, you're gonna get under each other's feet. And I feel like the first week, everyone was a bit excited. We got to try our homeschooling. And, and today, everyone's just a bit like on top of each other. And it feels a bit, I don't know, a bit, a bit suffocating. And I don't like, I don't actually like the term we're all stuck at home because I feel like we're not stuck at home, we're safe at home. Yeah, yeah. So we're all safe here at home, which is really, really good, but it's obviously gonna take some use to everyone getting used to constantly being together. And our children are like your children. I've had so many messages saying, why are your children always so well behaved? Mine won't stop fighting. So I'm filming this now to tell you guys, mine are on time out upstairs right now, all three of them, mm. for fighting. Mm. Others do fight, just like any other siblings. Not just fighting, we're talking full on screaming matches, man. Like full on screaming. Esme chose Isla a jumper from the charity box. 
and they'd made a rule that they weren't allowed to choose clothes from the charity box. The girl sorted out some clothes for charity the other day and she didn't want to put this jumper on because it was an itchy jumper and that's why she didn't want it and that's why it was going to charity. <laughs> it's just, oh. it's just, just normal sibling rubbish, you know what I'm saying, guys? But basically, they're on. everyone's on timeout right now. Me and Sarah are having a time. We're not having a timeout from each other. We're just... We, you, you get in the kitchen. We're having, a, we're, <laughs> <laughs> we're having a cup of tea together and then we're going to restart the day again. Everyone's going to get off timeout. I even had to get changed. I had to get changed because I was that, that like, I'm about to explode in a minute. <laughs> uh, oh, it's just been one of them days, guys, so far. It's been one of them days. Me and Sarah have had work to catch up on today, and we have been catching up on it today, and we've, we have caught up on it today, but it's take, it has taken its toll. It it's, taken a it's not taking its toll doing the work. It's just taking its toll trying to do the work, as well as looking after as as occupying the girls, and yeah. occupying the girls mm -hmm. who usually occupy themselves really well, because obviously they're old enough now. But, like I say, today, everyone's just like... Mum, she said this, and Isabel and Esme were fighting over lol dolls, and she'd set something up for her to play with. Oh, and the fights over it. lol dolls. Yeah, there's just been a there's lot been a of few. arguments since today. this morning. Since we got this morning, there's been a lot of, a lot of Isabel arguments. versus Esme mostly, and then Isla's been chipping, and then then like then all three of them been like, "Why are you getting involved, Isla? Oh my gosh!" <laughs> <laughs> all day long. Phone. Please comment below phones and tell us, y'all. Yeah, phones confiscated. are confiscated, <laughs> MacBooks confiscated, iPads confiscated. <laughs> All on the dining room table. Please comment below and tell us that y'all are going through the same things. And you relate, because I know, like, bare ton of you must relate. So... Go get my brew. Yeah, I need a brew. Let's do this. Okay, everyone. So, we are back. And <laughs> we all had to kind of just take an hour by ourselves. I think that with this whole situation, we're used to going to school all day, seeing our friends, um, and spending time apart from each other, and just having our own time away from each other. So, the fact that we've been together... Um, with each other for the last two ish weeks. Um, We're feeling a bit argumentative. <laughs> just a bit of an argue, just a bit argumentative. So we spent like the last hour and a half just in our own room, just just reading books and just trying to relax because it's very stressful being in the same house as two sisters, and it's just it got a bit stressful and a bit crazy, but. And we're all good now and we're going to continue the game isn't that right girls yeah we're going to continue the game we all love each other we're all friends aren't we friends, yeah. friends <laughs> forever friends forever what are you picking up read out loud go outside in the garden <gasps> we can yeah, just be in the garden let's go outside it's really cold we can bring some, we can all bring a doll outside why don't we do that oh we can play with those the the ball mm. things outside yeah, yeah. yeah let's go <laughs> These guys all just came out to play in the back garden. We've had some really bad wind today. My little tree's blown over my dead. I mean, I think, right, I need your opinions, guys, actually. Come on now. So this tree used to be on our front doorstep and it kind of died. It went all brown at the top, but the bottom of it's still, still green and looking all right. Does that mean it's still alive or is it dead? I'm not sure. Wait, ugh. I put him here because I'm just not sure if he is alive or dead. Hopefully he'll come back alive, but I'm not sure. Anyway, these guys were just playing in the back garden and Jace was just banging on the window like, come on, I need to go outside too. I'm a big boy too. So Jace is kind of like walking around, but as in running for a baby. So he's going like, to go down the <laughs> He was laughing his head off. As soon as I put him outside, he was like, yeah, come on girls. And he started chasing them and laughing. <laughs> so cute. Woo! in the garden jace came out as well it was so cute anyway we are now going to pick the next one and it is my turn to pick are you ready girls yeah. Yeah. i'm scared okay do a face mask now oh dear yeah. Yeah. Them in the evening oh okay 
a face mask all done. Now we're going to do the next one, Esme. You've got to pick this time, don't you? <laughs> no! Do a chore! Do and a chore choice. mom and dad can choose. So the girls just said I get to give them a chore. And one thing's really been winding me up the last couple of hours. And I've not done it. <laughs> the stay of the living room! Oh <laughs> you girls, make it spotless. <laughs> yes! Off you go! Okay. That was really fun. That was really fun. Really fun. My girl. Don't think it was fun, but alright. I think it was. Right, it's my girl to pick. Okay, I'll rummage it, rummage it around. <laughs> Read it. Play on the Xbox and buy a new game! Yeah! Okay, girls, I've just set up the Xbox. We're about to look at some games. <gasps> what, what type of game do you guys want? Maybe it's a car game. We've already, we've already got a car game, though. Um, we've how got about something called Horizon or something. Yeah. How about. Disney like, we've got a Disney game as well. We, I think we should have a look. I think it would be cool if, cool if we got like a game that's like like an game adventure game. game. Yeah. Like where we can do quests and things like that. I think that would be a good game to get. Yeah. Okay, so we couldn't get on to the store because we don't. It said it doesn't have any internet. I'm so confused. Um, but we can't get onto it now, so later on we're going to go onto it and buy um, a game. We also needed dad's, um, loads of dad's like email and loads of information and passwords and things like that. Dinner. And he's downstairs doing dinner, so we would have had to wait later anyway. So we're going to do that one later, so we're going to go pick another thing to do. Okay, so it's time to pick the next one. Are you ready girls? Yeah. <laughs> Give each other a makeover and leave it on for the rest of the day. That's why I said glue each other. I That's what you. I said. I'm I'm you. You. So Isla gets to do my makeup. I get to do Esme's and Esme gets to do Isla's makeup. Okay? Yeah! Okay, Esme, are you ready for me to do your makeup? Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah? No. <laughs> <laughs> to do me I'm just doing it today are you ready so nice okay you look pretty oh my gosh my highlighter oh it's really nice and why did i look mine is amazing i like the grinchy 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 it's unique i did it to be funny you did, did it, it to be funny well, i think you look cute you look like a little rabbit actually i do not yeah. look good why oh, do you not look good it compared to my neck and like my hands i know but that's only because you don't have your own foundation so we couldn't use your shades I'm so I had to use my shape. I did I'm I'm lie. Anyway, I'm lie. are we ready to pick the next one? Yeah! Okay, so we're going to now pick the next one. <laughs> Do some colouring, make a picture, saying thank you to mum and dad. Aww. <laughs> Okay, so we basically have to make like a little poster. Have, you've got some cards upstairs. Thank you. Don't you? Yeah, saying thank you to mum and dad for how amazing they are. It's just coming up to 8 pm. Ignore the clock, it's not the correct time. And we're getting ready to go outside and do the clap for all our key workers. I think it is officially an, NH um, an NHS clap. Yeah. But we're doing it for all key workers, including the NHS. For as well. everyone who's helping. For everyone who's out there helping. Are you girls ready? We've got two minutes. Woohoo! <laughs> oh, that's so nice. Woo! Oh my gosh, literally 
every single street on our house is out. Street in our house. On our, every single house on our street is out. Oh, there's fireworks going off. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. Come on, Daisy, do it. Come on, Daisy. Yay! Yay! Clap, Daisy! Yay! Oh, put me down, I'm going. No. Not gonna lie, it is almost Jace's birthday. Birthday. <laughs> it is almost Jace's bedtime. Peppa Pig's not on the telly still. Why are you still watching Peppa Pig, babe? Because yeah. I haven't no, been I've in been this living room for a while now. Okay. <laughs> God, he's himself down. Jace. <laughs> Jace, do it again. No, I'm not. Would you say that outfit's on back to front? No. <laughs> I say it's unbuttoned, Jace. <laughs> but it's not back to front. I had a lot to say to you guys tonight, but I can't remember what any of it was now. I want to say, mamas, dads, stay strong. Stay strong because times are testing. And I feel like in the first week, everyone had this novelty of homeschooling and all these uh, literally Pinterest mums galore. I was a Pinterest mum. Now, oh, far from Pinterest. You've had one bad day. Let's not give up on the first hurdle. No, I'm done. I'm done You've with You've had one bad day. That's it. I'm only joking. I am actually only joking. But today has been quite testing. But do you know what I've seen? And, and oh, this is going to get serious man. now. I've seen a lot of people on Facebook, a few a few people saying things like that how they're tired and they're they're finding it stressful and they're they're struggling mentally. Their mental health struggling. A few people struggle, struggling with depression and things like that. And I've got a cold, so my darling, don't touch my mouth. Um, and then other people come and saying you're only on week one of lockdown we've been on lockdown for three weeks and I just want to say that there's no limit on when you're allowed to have feelings like that some people can sit in the house for three weeks three months and it'd be completely fine and someone can spend three hours sat on their own in the house and feel completely depressed so it's not a comp why does it have my double chin why does it have to do that <laughs> it's not um a competition on how long you've been in the house and you've only you're only allowed to feel bad and you've been oh We'll come back after this short commercial break. But yeah, I just wanted to say, it's not a competition and don't let anyone else make you feel otherwise. And if you are feeling bad, then I'm sending you lots of love because I know how lonely this, this time is for a lot of people and how testing it is for some as well. Take Daddy's card. Good boy. You spend all the money. <laughs> Yay, you spent all Daddy's money. He feels like mummy feels when he's got that card. He's got my credit card, that's what he's doing. He's running off with my credit card right now because Sarah just spent a load of money online on sweets, on sweet. I'm supporting delivery. local businesses, that's yes, why. Yes, you are, I know. I keep saying to, keep saying to Chris, we need to order this. He's like, what is it? And I'm like, so-and-so, so-and-so. And he's like, why do we need that? We don't need it, but, you know, it's time to support local businesses. Small businesses. We need to support small businesses. If anyone lives in this area, Sweet Scoop in Yeadon is doing free deliveries. It's such an awesome guy. Amazing, amazing lovely, lovely guy. guy. Really lovely. And he's doing free deliveries to anyone in the local area. But he does also do, D, um, I think it was DPDS or, and Royal Mail. So he does do yeah, he does mail. Yeah, he does mail order all over the UK, but he does yeah. he does free delivery around the area where we are. So Yeah. And I kind of feel like I need to give another shout out to Sweet Company because I've been sat munching away. But I've been here now for about nine days. I arrived before we got back from the Maldives and oh they're delicious. So this company is called Sugar Fix. Maybe check them out as well. See if there's one in your local area. Look at this. Looks delicious. So Sweet Scoop. I'll show you their Instagram page in a second and also this one was sent to us by Sugar Fix. And this is Sweet Scoop. This is in Yeadon so if anyone lives in Leeds or anywhere around the area then go and check them out. They also do vegetarian, gluten free, vegan and loads of other absolutely delicious sweets because what help oh caramax tom the owner is amazing who loves caramax i don't know about anyone else. oh i ordered some of these today i ordered some of those because my nana used to buy these and um, when i was a lot younger and they're absolutely delicious oh do you remember those chewing gums babe Angelo bubbly gums. Oh, I should have got some of those as well. Oh my gosh, I need to get off of here right now. There are so many self-employed businesses that are sh having to close or are, at, are closed at the minute that are now facing ruin because of what's going on. So everyone is trying to innovate and come up with new ways of trying to stay afloat basically during this 
really, really scary time that we're going through right now. So make sure you check out both of them pages because, you know, we I'm need to support local, local businesses. I'm going to tag a load of small businesses on Instagram tomorrow. Yep. Anyone that needs to shout out. Who remembers the... Oh, your camera is such rubbish a light. I don't know it's orange in here. They're like green and you can get them in yellow and pink. The green, yellow and pink things. Comment down below if you've tasted these before. In fact, comment down below your favourite old-fashioned sweet shop sweets. And I'm going to see if I, uh, see what they are. Mine's those beer them. pint pot things. I ordered you some. I got you some on the order, I just did. Nice. Hey, it's thanking me nice, now. Nice, oh, nice, nice. Jace is, it's, it's time for Jace to go to bed now. Anyway, guys, so we're going to say, we're going to say goodnight. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you got to the end of this video. It was all good. Because today has been a toughie, without a doubt. No doubt we're going to encounter loads more toughies like this. And that's over okay. the next few months and that's okay but you know we just we just roll with it and do what we can do but thank you so much for sticking by us thank you so much for watching this video and um we love you all hope you're staying safe healthy happy and smiling <laughs> till tomorrow at five o'clock good night guys good night guys